everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Age Inquisition. I'm your host, Lasan Fay, and I'm not quite where I left off last time, and that's because I've taken a few minutes to do some inventory sorting. So I'm now down to three items in my inventory, and also to um, equip the party with uh, better gear, because that's what I tend to do when I inventory sort. So, before I do anything, though, because um, it's been since last year that I have filmed, um, I am going to go ahead and reassign all of the people. The name of our enemy. Um copy of the Liberalum tome that Dorian saw arrived at Skyhold along with a number of items ranging from rare manuscripts to grimoires for her magisters long dead. They came with a letter from the Grand Archivist apologizing profusely and stating a hope his gifts will be a benefit to the Inquisition. It may take some time for Dorian to go through the tome, but he seems optimistic that something will prove of use. Uh, College of Magi. Uh, the presence of Inquisition forces in the College of Magi provoked an angry response from Duke Sandral. I'm told this led to a standoff where the Duke's forces threatened to attack, and it was our agent at the College who talked the man down. Corbin displayed a level head and sound judgment, both things I would normally never ascribe to a dwarven warrior. The mobs have backed off, and Corbin sent to us the artifacts he believes uh, the Venatori may have been after. Colin. Great. And there, the Voldorma nobleman should no longer get in our way. Once my agents explained the situation to him, he was quite content to step away. The NFL's blacksmith weapon designs are ours. Great. Um, all right. Now I get to reassign people. Western approach. Ah, yes, translate the dragon text. Ambassador Montelier, I have been considering your last letter, and as I do owe you a debt of gratitude for handling the Cumberland incident, I think I have found something that may solve your mystery. I have an acquaintance in Minrathus who has a brother that circles College of Antiquities. Um... In that circles, College of Antiquities. A few favors, and he may be able to translate your ancient text, but I should warn you, they are likely to be costly favors. Still, this may be your most promising avenue. Do it. Ambassador, esteemed Ambassador Montelier, enclosed you will find the completed translation of your fascinating manuscript, which our scholars estimate to predate the first white. The dialect caused quite a stir in historical linguistics. The College of Antiquities would be most interested in further cooperation with the Inquisition should you uncover more to being documents from the pre-Blight era. Cordially, Anaximander uh, Vetri, Dean of Antiquities, Menrathus Circle. Um, not yet. We will do that on our time. Um, okay, so contact has been made. There are others in service to Corypheus. They were promised immortality in the next world and will spare no action in this one. They cannot fathom abandoning their master, and therefore they cannot imagine me abandoning their master. And that is your opening. I can give you all of these people, and I promise there are names among them, but they will, will not act, will not reveal themselves without a promise of victory that would weren't risking everything. Give me a target inquisitor. Place your people in that. In obvious weakness, a true tactical blunder that would legitimately pain you. It must be thus. They will sense any falseness. Reveal your side, and I will reveal the knife. And then you can take it. Take them. That is my plan. I know what it looks like. Perhaps I have fooled you all along, and now I have simply asked for you to grant me victory. 
but I play the game Inquisitor. Will you now play as well? Grand Duchess Florian de Chalons. Um, it is a risk, but she is not one of them. Say the word and a weakness will be known. Uh, make the promise. My people will watch the runners. We will get some of these conspirators, and the only one we will risk is her. Um, she is mad if she thinks we would commit to such a risk. Send her after some gossiping prat instead. Um, hmm. Alright, Liliana, Inquisitor. handle that. Um, I'll open that. Open that. Guess not. Anyways, uh, gather herbs, resources. Nightingale, um... Hmm, thinking. You know what, actually? Wycombe's new information regarding Duke... Or, I have new information regarding Duke Antoine of Wycombe. Wycombe's move against the Inquisitor's Dalish clan. It appears that Wycombe has been experiencing some sort of plague that only that affects only humans. The Duke has kept the news of the disease quiet as his fellow nobles grow louder in their anger, blaming the elves and the alienage for what has been called the knife-eared plague. Um, Antoine evidently chose to use Clan Lavalin as, an, as a scapegoat. His, sur his surreptitious move against the Dalish was an attempt to convince his nobles that he was taking action. Suspicions in the state city remain high. I can gather information, but any action on my part will be high risk. You know what? Josephine. Let us begin. Oh, right. That is for Dagna. Inquisitor, you have activated a number of elven artifacts used to detect magical energies of the veil. Individually, such readings have been helpful. If we can coordinate measurements of all the artifacts simultaneously, however, I believe we may be able to uncover uh, rifts that may not have opened yet. I've drafted a proposal for how we might use the Inquisition mages across Orlea and Ferelden to activate these artifacts in coordinated fashion, if you think that might be useful. Solus. All right. All right. Colin will... Guarantee safety. And that is everyone assigned. Um, okay. I think I know what that is. I know what that is. All right. Ugh. So, that being said, we're now done here. And I have the option to return to Frederick. And I will do so after I speak to Liliana. Working, I can see. Um, all right, up the stairs, up the stairs. Actually, since one of those quests was for you, Dorian, how are you feeling? Fancy meeting you here. Okay, I should go. Try not to die. I would notice you were gone. 
I'm glad. Grand Cleric Victoire has offered the Ambassador support for the Inquisition. Ah, Natalie is as persuasive as ever. You see. I'm told that Ambassador Montillier is pleased with the restraint you showed in Valence. Ugh, she's positively beside herself. I will never hear the end of it. Niceness before knives, Liliana. Haven't I always told you? Will that be all, my lady? For now. I love making new friends. Don't you? It was a gamble, Inquisitor, but it paid off. If you hadn't been with me at Valence, I would have killed Natalie. I'd have told you that I didn't have a choice. But there is always a choice. I am more than this. I am more than what Justinia made me. Do you resent Justinia for what she did? How can I when there is so much between us? When she gave her life for peace. No, I believe her intentions were pure. Most intentions are. The road to hell is paved with good intentions. What does this mean for my Inquisition? Will you still be my spy master? Of course. I would not give up my post. Not after everything we've built. I just know now that I shouldn't ignore my heart. Mercy is not always a weakness. You've exceeded her. She could never have imagined the power you now hold. And now I will know how to use that power wisely. I have to stay true to who I really am, before a spy master, left hand or bard. I almost lost myself. So you could almost say... Justinia set that up so that way Liliana could find herself again, as well. Arguably. Whee! Ah! Hey, I landed on the desk. And no fall damage. Uh, I... Thought I might have been finishing one of these, maybe it's upstairs, but... There's one other place I need to go before too long. And that is here. To my garden. Where I don't actually ignore my plants this playthrough. As I am prone to do. Hi. There is a problem that needs your attention, Inquisitor. Ah, thank you. All right. So now, now we go back to the Western approach. Because. I want to do this. It is time. Okay. And I'm going to pull Cassandra and Bull, because Bull needs something fun to do, and Solace, because I need someone who focuses on barriers. Deep Stalker fade. Doop -a -doop -a -doo. Loading. Ignore the requisitions officer. Actually, not the requisitions, potions. No. 
Okay. That tops off the Inquisitor. And Cassandra. Dorian's not with us. Solus. And Bull. Okay. Nope, I don't. Well, I don't know how you already lost health, but okay. What was that? Oh, my fellow researcher. What can I do for you? Here, manuscript. My people have translated that to Vinter manuscript. Oh, studies on dragon hunting patterns, migrations. <laughs> Durant's theory that dragons can't see the color blue is refuted. With those dreadful raiders out of the way, we can finally lure out the abyssal high dragon. <laughs> you should have the honor, my friend. I've made note of the appropriate spots in the wastes for you to place lures. Place this bait, and then wait. <laughs> it will be a momentous achievement in draconology. Okay. I'm off to plant the bait for the high dragon. I cannot wait to hear your observations. You must make note of how she circles the hunting area. All right. We'll have to speak some other time. Yeah, so um, I upgraded um, Faye's armor, and then I tinted it. Um, I originally actually meant for it to look like what she wears in Skyhold, but wound up actually doing the inverse of that. And you know what? I actually really like how it came out. So I, you know what? Let's, let's just start over here. Lure one. Really, and I'm putting them back on top of these bear traps that I supposedly disabled. Three. Come on. For and for the piece de resistance, we have five. Though, real quick, I'm gonna sneeze. Excuse me. Boss, I want you to know, you're the best. I try. Where is she coming in from? A dragon. I suppose we must fight it. Where? Ah, oh, there she is. Look at that magnificence. And I am clearly using the wrong weapon for this, or the wrong type of staff for this. But that's okay. Solus is real wielding a good one.
Y'all stay healthy. Cage doesn't have that kind of range, does it? Is that the issue? Cool, if you need it, take the health potion. that would take me through the leg, but it didn't. Alright. Ow! God, you like throwing those at me. And I'm the one who does the least amount of harm to you. You're back up in action. It's got its bleeding legs. Ah. Not quite as panicky as the last one we dealt with. Ugh, but it brings out that stupid armor. We've got armor piercing. Yeah, that wasn't as bad as the last dragon. I didn't entirely prep well for the last dragon. I was kind of just in a state of, eh, let's go do a thing. It'll be fine. Did I already claim? Uh, 
I think so, since I've got that. Doesn't make sense for me to have gone there without claiming the quarry. Very unlikely that she could be nesting at this time of year. Ah, fellow researcher, how can I help you? Uh, dragon's dead. The high dragon attacked me when I planted the bait. I'm afraid it's dead. She attacked? How wonderful! You had a first hand view of her behavior. Return whenever you like. I'm always glad. To ah! Oh no! Sorry. Sorry about this. Uh. Good job, Solus. Okay. After more than thirty days, I have yet to observe the abyssal high dragon in oh yes? Can I assist you? Okay, let's actually. The high dragon attacked me when I planted the bait. I'm afraid it's dead. She attacked. How wonderful! You had a first-hand view of her behavior. Did you take any notes on her aggressive posturing? No. I suppose you wouldn't have. <laughs> no matter. I should very much like to interview you uh, at a later time, of course. You should talk to I could Bull. Your inquisition. My expertise could be of use, and your scouts could help me find other specimens. Please. Certainly. I'm sure the Inquisition could use the Draconologist. Excellent. I'm sure my research will be of great use to you. Whew. All right. Woo. All right. What else did I have out here that I haven't finished? You know what? Since I'm out here. I'll go ahead and do this. Unfortunately, the red leather does not quite hide the blood stains of my enemies. Wahaha. Ah, yes, there it is. I see it. The end must be nearby. Yeah, great. Let's assume it's down the ravine. Ah. And indeed. It is. Did I skip something? Ah, letter. Rebel Mage's notes. It keeps, it just keeps staring at me. It had to go. Okay, is it right? All right, let's let's go ahead take out the bear here. But we shall see what is in this cave next time. I want to thank you all so much for tuning in, and in the meantime, in between time, take care, have fun, happy trails.